Hey, it's Big T. Uh, today I am going to do a quick uh, video on making your own dumbbell eyes, um, heavier lead eyes. So, so what we're going to do first is I've got a piece of 50 pound monofilament right here. And what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to get a lighter and we're going to burn this end and we're, we're going to burn it until it makes a little bit of a bulb on the end of that. Uh, you may have done this if you do any salt water tying. It, it's kind of a way to make a, a crustacean eye for a shrimp or a crab pattern. And then I'm going to trim that off on the other end so that we've got just about an inch to work with. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab, this is a 2.7 millimeter Big T tungsten countersunk ball bead and, and I'm going to put that through the monofilament and I'm actually going to go what, what we would call backwards I guess in that I'm, I'm taking the monofilament through the larger end. And having the end that normally would go through the hook point uh, pointed towards me. Or pointed upwards in this case if I'm if I'm holding it this way. Then I'm gonna take some feather hackle pliers and I'm going to clamp those down just above that bead and we will thread another 2.7 millimeter bead and this time we're going to take that side that we would normally put through the hook point and put the monofilament through so we've got our wider end on top here and I'm going to trim that off leaving about an eighth, maybe quarter inch of monofilament. And then I'm going to light this end and let that burn down until it gets to the top there. So what we have now is two tungsten beads with a short piece of monofilament going between them. And what I can actually do with this is go ahead, I'll start some thread on this hook and then place these on top. and I can run some X wraps and what I'll also like to do is run some thread on each side so that I make sure I get these beads tightened down and put against the outside of that. So that's a quick easy way to make some dumbbell eyes, uh, some heavy lead eyes for uh, any of your sh small streamers. Heck, you could go down and put uh, size maybe 20 pound test, maybe even 10, and go to some really small one and a half or two millimeter beads uh, and use those on your bigger nymphs. I uh, hope you put this technique to work and it catches some fish for you. Uh, for these uh, supplies you can visit my store at bigtflyfishing.com and subscribe to my channel if you would please.